wants the speedy things. The really obnoxiously fast ones. I feel like this whole chapter has just been an enormously never-ending fight. Here we go. Get a little bit of a break here. Light. Hunting rifle ammo. Oh, good. Three whole new shots. That was basically entirely luck that I got him. I didn't actually see him right now. Tree is coming down. Pulling out all the stuff to keep me away from the lake, huh? Pretty much shooting the entire town of Bright Falls at this point. Another one of those guys? It actually looks like there's two of them. on me behind the thing, the train. Alright, now there's only one, and I only have two bullets left in that, so we're going to switch to this rifle, and hope that's enough to take one of these guys down. Where'd he go? He was right next to me. You guys are obnoxious because of how fast they are. Alright. I officially have, like, no bullets. I think I have two revolver, yeah, two revolver and one rifle, and then I've got to use the flare gun for everything. We got lucky there, and he kind of stumbled into a bunch of explosives. All right, let's turn this on so we can grab the ammo in peace. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, shotgun ammo. The gun I don't have. But at least we got a little bit of revolver ammo. Ah, uh, in 
incoming train. Well, that that was very close to hitting me. What's that noise? Oh! Alright, so we're just having enormous things thrown at us now. Sounds like yet more taken. supplies. Step two. Press the button. I needed to get the generator running. Huh. Step three. Get the generator running. Right about now they're gonna come running at me. I'm rather surprised that they didn't come at me. Although I hear a chainsaw, so. There they come. But I happen to have a ton of flashbangs, so. I had that equipped. I still hear the fast guy somewhere. As always, ass shots win. After Zane had gone, I stood alone in the shifting dream that was the dark place. I had to find a way to the cabin. I'd written myself a way through this place in the manuscript. I followed the idea of a path. I had written myself across the ocean that blocked my way, and with that, there was a bridge to the island beyond. The idea of the cabin flickered in the underwater darkness. I willed the cabin to be real, and it was. Turn back now. No, what makes you think I would do that? You know what? Screw you and your roadblock.
rocks. Come on, Alan. Aha! That's the sign. We made it. We set to get past whatever this is. Oh, hello. Destroy the tornado. Okay. Uh, how? I'm open to suggestions. It's just flinging cars at me, huh? Giant box of flare gun. So just start shooting flare guns at her. Oh no! <laughs> I got hit by a car. That's not good. Let's try that again. after me. And that's a kill. <laughs> no, don't not, no! Why would you ever throw that away? Keep it in your pocket. They're supposed to be waterproof, aren't they? Just another nightmare. No. Everything's fine. You're home. It wasn't a dream. I don't sleep in three jackets, fine. jeans, and shoes. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on! Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. Come back to bed, and I'll make you forget all about your fear in the dark. No. My fear? It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Where's the clicker? What did you do with it? Alan, you're scaring me now. Come back to bed. Have you taken your pills? Do you want me to call Dr. Hartman? <gasps> Come back to bed, Alan. <gasps> Come Ow. back to bed, Tom. I can see the word clicker. your manuscript. It's brilliant. Departure is your best work yet. You're a genius. I'm so proud of you. Yeah, screw you. Oh, hey! Good old floating Tom. You must find your way to the cabin. It stands in your way. It won't let you pass. It has no heart. It's filled with darkness. You must fill its heart with light. Uh, 
Let's use the clicker. I can make things appear by shining the flashlight at them, which is pretty cool. I think I just want the path. Shoebox. I'm leaving you. What? I'm leaving you, Alan. I met someone. I'm in love with someone else. Alice? No, what do you say? You can't... You don't love me? How could you? You don't even love yourself. All you do is torture yourself with work you can't do anymore. No, I, I love you more than anything in the world. You're... you're my muse. I'm not. Who are you? What have you done with my Alice? Alan? What are you doing? Put the light back on. What are you doing, Alan? Stop! Put the light back on! Right, well, I guess we want bird leg true. cabin. Nothing like that had ever happened. You're not my Barbara. Tom, let me go. I promise to be good. Please, I'm tiny, you naughty boy. I will help you watch your masterpiece. I will love you forever. No, you're not Barbara Jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. You came back wrong. Your heart is filled with darkness. Put that knife away, Thomas. Put it down. My heart is filled with darkness now. I'll cut it out. Oh! Oh! I'll take you back to the depths of Pedro. Sounds like Tom went a bit nutty in the end. Now you will never get her back. I am much older than you. Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Ah, someone else to dream me free. Bye bye, Barbara. I could feel Alice's presence close by. I understood what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to departure. There's light and there's darkness. Cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. There's a long journey through the night back into the light.
Alice is out. Freedom! Fast. <laughs> yeah, old gods. like Agent Nightingale, I think, creeping from the window behind her. Yeah, it's Nightingale. It's not a lake. It's an ocean. Alan, wake up. There we go. That's Alan Wake Remastered, but hang on because we're not done quite yet. That is the end of the base game, but there are two more uh, DLC chapters that will expand on that ending a little bit. I know that was kind of vague uh, as to what just happened. So clearly Alice is out of the lake, but it's unclear what Alan is up to. And uh, what did that all mean with uh, Nightingale and the new lamp lady at the end, uh, uh, Rose? Uh, so we've got some questions to be answered. Not, not all of them are going to be answered here, but... We'll, we'll get through the next two DLC chapters. Um, obviously, I love this game. Uh, I'm sharing it with you. And we've got Space Oddity playing over the background here. Um, but yeah, I, I really like Alan Wake. I think it's a fantastic game. The, the little ending part there was a bit of a drag because it was just fighting the entire time. And I think that's not necessarily the strong, the strong suit of this game. It's just straight fighting forever. But, like, you know... The, the plot was interesting. I felt like it kept me engaged the whole time. I liked the light dark mechanic with like the interesting take on the kind of survival horror third person shooter. We have to fight both the darkness shields on the enemies and then shoot them afterwards. It made for an interesting gameplay. Obviously, this game is more than 10 years old and this is a remaster of it, so uh, some of the gameplay decisions are a bit dated, but you know, that is what it is for an old game. But I, Remedy, I feel, has a really good grasp on storytelling in games, and I really enjoy it. Um, so, you know, uh, very positive vibes on this one. I've, I've played it a bunch of times. Uh, I love it. Uh, and so we have reached the end of Alan Wick. Um, there's quite a bit of credits. I can't talk through all of them. So I'm probably just going to skip through to the end, uh, and we will pick up afterwards. Alan Wake's journey through the night will continue. Although fans at the time this game came out uh, would not have any idea quite how long it would take because we are just now, in 2021, finding more about what Alan Wake was, uh, is going to look like in the future. But I'll leave that for later. We'll talk more about that as we get into it. Uh, we do have uh, a little bit more to go, I believe. Let's see, episodes, normal. Yeah, we can. We gotta play through the signal and the writer. So we'll do those next. Um, it is actually quite late where I am. So we're gonna pause that and we'll pick up 
with the signal uh, next time. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, I appreciate you hanging with me, and we will finish off Alan Wake Remastered in style next time. See you later.